Good morning, students. I hope you all are fit and fine at home and doing your studies sincerely. I welcome you all to the EVS class. Children, presently we are going on with our seventh lesson in EVS, which is our celebrations. And we have done a few exercises in copies. I hope. You all have gone through the explanation video of this chapter carefully, done the reading of the chapter thoroughly and have understood the lesson well. What we are going to do today is, we are going to revise everything what we have learnt in this lesson and then we will solve some exercises to check our understanding. All right, so let's begin. As the name of the lesson says, are celebrations. What does the word celebration mean? It means an act of celebrating an important or special day or an event. And there are so many occasions and festivals that we celebrate with our family. For example, we celebrate our birthdays, wedding anniversaries of our parents or grandparents. We also enjoy at the success of any family members. And how can we forget if there is a wedding in our family? We have great fun, isn't it? So children, all these occasions like birthdays, anniversaries, etc. are family celebrations. So this we need to remember. What are family celebrations? The occasions like Birthdays, anniversaries, etc. These are family celebrations. All right. But besides this, we also celebrate many festivals during the year. And festivals mean lot of fun, music, dance wearing new clothes and having variety of delicious food, isn't it? That's why we love festivals. So let us study about festivals that we celebrate in India. Children, there are three types of festivals celebrated in India. The first type is religious festivals. Second, National festivals. And the third one Harvest festivals. So repeat all of you once again what are the three types of festivals in India? Religious festivals national festivals and harvest festivals all right so let us understand what these are religious festivals are those festivals which are related to particular religion like holy The Sarah the 
दीपावली ईद गुरु पर्व एंड क्रिसमस नेशनल फेस्टिवल्स आर इंडिपेंडेंस डे सेकेंड रिपब्लिक डे एंड द थर्ड वन गांधी जयंती All right and harvest festivals celebrated are Pongal Onam Baisakhi and Bihu okay national festivals are the festivals which are related to our country or nation and harvest festivals are those festivals which are celebrated at the time of harvest and harvest means cutting and gathering of food crops all right now let us revise all these festivals in detail the first one is Holi Children Holi is the very popular festival of the Hindus it is also known as the festival of colors we play with gulal and colored water a special sweet dish called gujiya is prepared on this occasion the next is the shera The Shera is also one of the most popular festivals of the Hindus. It is celebrated at the victory of good over evil. On this day, the effigies of demons like Ravan, Kumkaran and Meghnath are burnt. And we celebrate this festival because Lord Ram had killed Ravan on this day. the next one deepavali deepavali or the or diwali is known as the festival of lights we celebrate it by lighting candles diyas and bulbs we also make rangolis we exchange sweets and gifts with our relatives and families goddess Lakshmi is worshipped on this day and we celebrate this festival because Lord Ram had returned to Ayodhya after a prolonged exile of 14 years all right and how can we forget we also burn crackers on this festival the next festival is Eid Eid is a very important festival of the Muslims It is celebrated after the holy month of Ramzan. During the month of Ramzan, Muslims fast and pray. And on the day of Eid, people wear new clothes. They go to mosques to pray. They embrace each other and say Eid Mubarak. Sewai is the special dish prepared on this occasion. Next is Guru Parv. It is celebrated to mark the birthdays of ten Sikh gurus. The gurdwaras are decorated with lights on this day, and people go to gurdwaras to pray. Langar is distributed in gurdwaras, and special processions are taken out. The last one is Christmas. What comes to your mind when you hear the word Christmas? Yes, Santa Claus and 
Christmas tree. But why do we celebrate this festival? We celebrate it because it is the birthday of Jesus Christ. On this day, people decorate Christmas trees and children wait for Santa Claus for them to bring the gifts. Christmas is celebrated on 25th of December every year. Coming to the national festivals, the first one is Independence Day. It is celebrated on 15th August every year. On this day, India got freedom from the British rules. The Prime Minister of India hoists the national flag at the Red Fort in Delhi. We remember our great freedom fighters on this day. The next national festival is Republic Day. It is celebrated on 26th of January every year. A grand parade is held on this day at Rajpath in New Delhi. The President of India unfurls the national flag and takes the salute of the parade. The third national festival is Gandhi Jayanti. It is the birthday of Mahatma Gandhi. He is known as the father of the nation and is lovingly called as Bapu. The next kind of festival is the harvest festivals. The first one is Pongal. Pongal is celebrated in Tamil Nadu. On this occasion, people worship the sun god and a special dish called Pongal rice is prepared on this occasion. The second harvest festival is Onam. It is also known as the festival of flowers and this festival is celebrated in Kerala. On this occasion, snake boat races are held. The next one is Baisakhi. This festival is celebrated in Punjab. On this day, people wear colorful clothes and folk dance like Bhangra and Gidh are organized. The last one is Bihu. Bihu is the harvest festival of Assam. And Bihu dance is the main attraction of this festival. So children, that was all about these festivals. I hope all these festivals are clear to all. And now, let me give you some exercises so to check how much you have understood. Fill in the blanks. Let me see how much you remember. You are going to tell me the answers, alright? These exercises we have already done in copy. Now answer. We celebrate many dash with our family. What do we celebrate with our families? Many festivals, right? Festivals are a lot of, what do we have? During the festivals, we have a lot of fun, yes. Don't we enjoy all the festivals? The third one. We celebrate dash of many great Personalities. What do we celebrate of many great personalities? Yes, just now I repeated, we had revised just now. 
we celebrate birthdays yes birthdays of great personalities the fourth one festivals spread joy and dash what should we fill here come on all right festivals spread joy and happiness everybody feels happy during the time of festivals so this we have solved now we are going to have an interesting exercise it is a activity based all right i'm sure you're going to enjoy it so children this is our second exercise and what you can see in my hand i have the names of different festivals and in this exercise we have to arrange the given festivals under the correct heads the table is provided here with three columns the first one is the column of national festivals second religious festival and the third one harvest festival so let us classify these festivals the first festival is republic day so where should we put this under which column should we put republic day is a national festival are you sure yes it is a national festival so we are going to put it here all right the next one the shehra which kind of festival is it is it a national festival no is it a religious festival yes so it goes over here all right the next one baisakhi remember about baisakhi it is the harvest festival of punjab so where should it go it should be under harvest festivals correct the next one which festival is this read eid is it a national festival no religious festival yes why because it is the festival of muslims all right the next one is holi what about this festival is this a national festival no religious festival yes so again it will go under religious festival the next one we have is gandhi jayanti which kind of festival is it is it a harvest festival no religious festival of course not it is a national festival and when do we celebrate this festival on 2nd of october next we have onam which kind of festival is it come on is it national festival no religious festival no it is the harvest festival of which place it is the harvest festival of kerala so it goes under harvest festival all right now let us continue we have left we are left with few more festivals the next one we have is guru parv it is the religious festival of six so it should go here all right the next one is deepavali now tell me which kind of festival is this is it a national festival 
no religious festival yes so this again goes under religious festival can you tell which diwali or deepavali means the same and what what is it known as it is also known as the festival of lights correct then next we have is christmas so christmas is which kind of festival children harvest festival no national festival no it is the religious festival it is the festival of christians all right then we have bihu remember bihu it is the harvest festival of which place assam yes it is an harvest festival the next one independence day recently we had celebrated independence day remember children so which type of festival is it it is a national festival the whole country celebrates it so we will put this under this column and the last one we are left with is pongal is it national festival no we have in india we have only three national festivals that is over is it religious festival no because pongal is the harvest festival of which place tamil nadu all right so we'll put this under here so did you enjoy this exercise i hope you enjoyed this one so children let us solve one more interesting exercise all right so look at this exercise exercise third name the following here you have to tell the name of the festivals you have to guess which festival is it the festival of lights the first one can you tell which festival is it festival of lights you can choose from here which festival is it correct it is deepavali so our answer will be deepavali deepavali is also known as the festival of lights so this is our answer the second one national festival celebrated on 2nd october can you tell which festival is it what do we celebrate on 2nd october you are right gandhi jayanti so let us pick from here gandhi jayanti and here we have got the answer this is our answer third one we eat sevai on this festival so which festival is this when we eat sevai recall it is eid so let us pick our answer here we have got our answer eid effigies of ravana kumkaran and meghnath are burnt so on which festival do we burn the effigies of these demons say it is again sorry it is again the religious festival which is the sehra so here we have got the answer of this one also so i hope you all have understood this chapter very well and it all the festivals are clear to all your assignment will be do these exercises in your rough copies and i will meet you in the next video till then take good care of yourself bye and god bless you